it's mason welcome to my youtube channel where i talk about everything that i want to why because my word is law i'm right you're wrong and i have really good taste and i like to share that with the masses so today we're gonna be talking about the essential things that every hottie needs in their purse <laughs> A hot person's bag is essential. This we know. It's so important to have a killer bag. You never know what you're gonna need. My mama always told me, you stay ready. So you ain't gotta what? So you ain't gotta get ready, okay? So that's why I'm gonna go through what I have in my purse so y'all can know, you know, like, I have to lead by example. So I'm gonna show you the example of what a baddie has in their purse. Um, so let's get into it first off the bag itself so i have a bunch of bags for a bunch of different purposes this is my go-to like baddie bag this has the space and the capacity for everything i need without busting out my big ass telfar because if i bring my telfar out then i'm gonna start throwing shit that i don't even need in there like i went into a store with my telfar i came back out with like a bag of crab legs in there like did i need to do that i did not um big bags uh promote greed so it's best <laughs> that you have this is all satire it's best that you have you know a good little medium little you know little medium sized bag so this is my bag coach 2000 something i don't know uh i want to say like 2000 i don't know it's like really cute and y'all just don't have it <laughs> thrifted so yeah, first things first, a snack. A bad bitch gonna have a snack in their purse. A bad bitch is gonna have crumbs in their purse. People shit on me or with my friends and family, it's a running joke that I always got crumbs in the bottom of my purse. Yes, I have crumbs in the bottom of my purse. Why? Because I always have a snack. And it's all fun and games. Oh, oh, you always got crumbs in your purse. <laughs> I crumbs in your purse until y'all need a snack. Then it's, ooh, I know you got a snack in your purse because you always got one. Yeah. So, yeah. My snack of choice, hot fries, um, hot chips, um, something that's going to stain your fingers and you can eat them real sexy and cute. Keep some gum. A bad bitch going to have gum in their purse. I ran out, but I'm going to have some gum in my purse. You see. Or a little Debbie cake. Some, some, you, know, you, can, you can snack on it. Yeah. So, yeah. That's what I have in my purse for snacks two a cute wallet a classy wallet i like to match my purse to my wallet i'm a coach girl my mother was a coach girl my grandmother was a coach girl i love coach coach sponsored me so you know i gotta have a coach wallet and this is this is a checkbook if you a real bad bitch you're not only gonna have a checkbook oh no if you a real bad bitch not only will you have a wallet you will have a checkbook because you're writing checks. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Get you a cute little... You can stuff anything in here. So, aside from that... Um... An edible. So... An edible is a fun little snack. Um... You never know when a party's gonna happen. Or, uh... When you're gonna need a party favor. So... I like to keep a pre-roll or an edible in my purse. Because, honestly... Y'all be pissing me off so bad. I be needing just a little real quick before i go on about my day um because y'all be pissing me off so yeah you always need a party favor and it's always good to break the ice you know it's you can always start a conversation oh hey you know the universal you know so yeah of course we got tampons you never know who's gonna need a tampon all my heavy flow baddies rise up this i have this tampon but honestly i need to get different ones because these don't do I feel like the deep, the blood goes around these, honestly. They're kind of a waste. I need the super ones. Shout out Heavy Flow. But, um, yeah. Next, lip glosses. Lip glosses have their own segment. You need three. And if you're like me, you use lip glosses all day, all night, all the time. So, it's like, it's important to have at least three that you can pick from. So, my three of choice right now. 
of course, of course, of course, a Fenty gloss of some sort. If you do not have a Fenty gloss in your purse, you are not a bad bitch. Turn in your bad bitch registration card. Um, deactivate your account on bad bitches online. Um, jump off the side of a bridge. If you do not have a Fenty lip gloss. Fenty sponsor me. Um, my gloss of choice. Hot cocoa, obviously. Love the shine. Goes with any, you can do it with no makeup, you can do it with makeup. Like, come on now. Come on now. It's an instant look. And then if I want like a little cute pinky one, this Milani, this Milani light pink, sparkling pink. This is a lip plumper as well. Out of your glosses, one of them needs to be a lip plumper. Oh, they make my lip sync. I don't care. You need a lip plumper because it's cute and um it gives you an instant lip filler and it's like it's lip filler without the commitment of lip filler because i feel like lip filler is kind of dumb but sometimes i like the aesthetic of like it's fun it makes me feel like i'm on legally blonde so you need a lip plumper keep it full and then you just need a basic clear gloss after that i lost mine which is why you need three so i just have this chapstick i think i stole it from my ex i don't know but um yeah if it were my choice this would be a clear gloss and like that's what you would need so the next thing you need to have is a cute pair of glasses you never know when you want to spice up your look and you need some cute a little pick-me-up so i like having a pair of gun i like keeping a pair of sunglasses in my purse for when i get really drunk especially if it's a night out i'm going out to party dance um you bring sunglasses so when you're like super messed up at the club you're not like in pictures you know you know you know so you don't look super effed up and i like a cute pair of glasses so when i'm boying <laughs> in public i don't look like even though i have no problem looking like that because like y'all aren't gonna sue me but like you know just a cute it instantly goes from a simple like look to like oh okay glasses like they read they can read a book and it's like yes i do read so yeah keep some glasses in your purse um i think my face makeup looks really cute no makeup makeup look i have on blush highlight um that's not what this video is about, and y'all don't care. Anyway, uh, <laughs> speeding right along. Oops. The next thing you need to have in your purse, the next thing you need to have in your purse is perfume. Something cute, something fun, something that smells nice. I love warm scents. I love a good vanilla. You can't go wrong with vanilla. Like, everybody loves vanilla. Um, if I want a more masculine scent, then I'll go for, like, those pines, like, woodsy smells. Like, I want to, when I'm in my stud flow, when I'm in my more masculine, in my masculinity, I want, you know, something, something rustic. Something that says... I chop wood in the forest. That's not the purse for that. I have a separate purse. It's a satchel, actually. I have a separate satchel for those looks. And they have, like, my more masculine, my my aquatic, masculine, fresh linen smells. So, that's not what this purse is for. This is Noir Tees. I took, also took this from my ex, I think. Um, hey, babe. You need a cute little body mist, so, you know, you just got out of the sesh, you know what I'm saying? You boom, 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 take a lap around your car. You are a baddie who participates in the uh, oregano, um, um, if you smoke cigarettes, uh, the earth cigarettes, that sort of thing. You're going to want to make sure that you don't smell too much like it, or you're going to want something that mixes well. You want your perfume to mix well with it, so it all smells together, so it's like, it's like a, a, whiff, a whiff of it, but it's like a base note but yeah you're gonna want to get smells that have like a woodsy base a smoky base uh like a amber uh what's that one thing amber vanilla like velvety type smells because you know so because smoke has like that smoky flair so when it all mixes together especially if you use like natural hair products like the shea butter and the cocoa butter and all that that a vanilla perfume and some gas you're gonna smell really good like i get compliments like oh you smell really good somebody smells really good like what's smelling smelling like that gas this is my cologne like 
yeah that's my cologne so yeah that's my segment on perfume moving on so other things that you need in your purse so if you're like me you get bored like really really easy i have adhd so like, i get bored all the time and like i have all these games and like apps on my phone and like do all this other stuff but it's like it still gets boring because like i don't know the apps all run together to, to me after a while it all gets boring everything tweets the same stuff it's boring so i like to keep a little book so this book i took it from Barnes and Nobles um it's called all the sign all signs point to yes and it's about romances it's 13 romances for the 13 13 12 zodiac signs so I'm like that seems really cute so I keep that in my bag and like ideally I would be reading this as well especially like there's nothing like oh you're on the train and you're like you're like sitting down and they're like oh oh they're reading what are they reading and you're like reading your book and you're like is like really sexy and dignified and like very hot and smart and so they're like oh my gosh they read because you're a bad bitch you know you're you're multifaceted so like they should know so it's like reading is fun it's a good way to spend like past time without being on your phone you'll see you reading a book and they're like oh my god they read like not only are they super sexy and well-dressed they also read books too and you'll be like yes i read books too and they'll be like oh my gosh here's a million dollars like Anyways, that's what happens for me when I read in public. <laughs> it doesn't happen for me. But, yeah, I like to keep a good book because it's a good way to start conversation. It's a good way to, like, you know, I just like carrying books around. Um, the book I'm reading right now, like, if you don't have space in your purse for a physical book, then just have a book on your phone. Uh, the book I'm reading on my phone is Freshwater. It's really, really, really good. I highly recommend it. I highly recommend um so yeah keep a book with you the next thing that i'm gonna tell you you need in your purse is so essential it's so essential it's so essential um i lost it i lose it all the time i lose it like how i lose my phone which is also all the time but normally i don't leave the house without it but i lost it <laughs> so i'm just gonna use a game you have to have a switch in your purse. It is so essential for you to have a switch in your purse. I left, I lost my switch, so I'm holding a switch game, but you need to have a switch game in your purse. And I'm so, I'm serious as a heart attack right now. You need to have a switch game in your purse. Why don't you have a switch game in your purse? So I love Animal Crossing um it's my favorite game right now i got bayonetta i really think she's really cute she's super cunt i always good i always play her in smash bros but the game's really really hard like and well to be fair i'm not good at video games but this is like damn they were kicking my ass in this game i haven't gotten past chapter two <laughs> or like level two because it's like really difficult and like i'm losing I don't like losing yeah i don't like losing so i haven't been playing it but like you have to have your switch your switch serves as the same function of you having your book and so it's where like you're bored you're like okay i'll play my switch you play your switch it's a great way to start a conversation with other people because they're like oh my gosh you have a switch what games do you like da, 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 da. so you need to have a switch in your purse and when you're bored you don't want to get on your phone and you don't want to read because like right now you're feeling like books are lame and like maybe you want to look cool and play switch instead games are kind of nerdy too though so i don't know if that works but maybe you're just tired of reading i get tired of reading too i get tired of a lot of stuff i uh <sighs> I'm like really impatient but yeah that is what else you need in your purse let me see what else you need in your purse ask still wear a mask people should let oh covid is over duh, duh, duh. i don't care i'm still gonna wear my mask why because i have not gotten seriously sick since the pandemic happened because i never stopped wearing my mask like i used to get sick religiously like all the time I wear my mask still and now i don't so like you should definitely keep wearing it um a dab pen you never know a dab pen um you should always have a dab pen with you because baddies hit dab pens duh um cake sponsor me um herb sponsor me cookie sponsor me please 
so yeah you need this you need a dapper um you need a lighter you need a cute lighter playboy lighter preferably a really sexy one go to your megan fox i'm so cute <laughs> so yeah you need a lighter um you need a quarter that's not a quarter but you need a quarter you need change just in case um you have to go to aldi's um yeah i think that's everything those are my bag essentials this is what i essentially have in my bag um this is what hot people put in their bags this is what really sexy people put in their bags if you're a hot and sexy person you have these essentials you have entertainment what uh what the heck a purse is actually for monetary um compensation snackies um menstrual 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 assorted party favors glosses mask perfume accessories essential alrighty so yes that was what's in my bag thank you for watching like and subscribe But yeah, like and subscribe. I'm really smart. Thank you.